Hello friends, welcome to another video on my YouTube channel and in this video we will look into newly released OpenAI GPT model series called GPT 4.1. It has three variants GPT 4.1, GPT 4.1 Nano and 4.1 Mini. So in this video let's understand the performance and see how the pricing compared to the previous generation of the gpt models let's get started i'm here on official models page you can see uh, we have previously released reasoning models then we have flagship chat models this flagship chat models are you know categorized into two main part uh, flagship and cost optimized model the 4.1 uh, 4.0 4.0 audio and chat gpt 4.0 these four are the flagship model and this is recently released in the cost optimization models we have 4.0 mini and now we have 4.1 nano and 4.1 mini so let's see the pricing of these models if we compare the pricing of uh, 4.1 and 4.0 then you will see that it is now reduced a bit because uh, 4.0 has 2.5 dollars per million input token and 10 dollars per million output token while this newly released gpt 4.1 has reduced dollar 2 and dollar 8 respectively for input and output million tokens and if you see here 4.1 and 4.0 nano which has 0.40 and 0.10 input million token pricing which compares to this is uh, higher in terms of mini but nano has very reduced pricing and for output token as well this is 1.60 this is for uh, 0.40 while this is at point 60 so it sits between uh, nano and mini 4.1 model but if you compare the performance of these models on this official open ai blog post it has you know coding instruction following and long con context uh, benchmarks so if you see here this under intelligence uh, multilingual mmlu uh, benchmark if you see the latency uh, 4.1 nano sits here 4.1 mini is way ahead of 40 mini but if you compare 4.1 and 40 this seems you know uh, identical in performance there is no bigger improvement though there is improvements but not you know bigger improvements and that's why if you see here the pricing are reduced compared to 4.0 if you see the coding then 4.1 performs better than all the previous you know 4.5 as you know they said in their uh, video as well 4.5 was experiment and which was not up to the mark then if you compare with 4.0 it is higher and against o1 high and o3 mini it is higher in multilingual 4.1 seems to perform better and in you know real world example uh, windsurf has partnered with open ai maybe cause the founder of windsurf was there on the uh, on on the introduction video of 4.1 as well so it, it says that it is you know working better and under instruction following if you can see here obviously it is higher uh, compared to 4.0 but you know it is kind of nearer to o1 o3 mini and 4.5 so but if you see here this you know mini and nano performs better than 4.0 itself so this is a kind of an improvement i will provide the link of this blog into the description so that in case you want to take a deeper look 
you can do that so i hope you now understand that open ai 4.1 is kind of an improvement compared to the previous generation of the model in terms of you know chat completion or chat based model and the pricing is fairly cheaper compared to the previous generation of models so that you can you know take a spin of these models and i'm eager to see what you can build with these models and if you build something out of these models please let me know in the comment section i hope this video helps you understand the newer generation of the open ai models and if it does so please consider subscribing to my channel that helps Thank you for watching, enjoy the life, feel the music, peace.